the right angles? Yeah, because I got this one going. Oh, and it works just fine? And we're live. Yeah. See? It started out with me saying, because I got this one going. Oh. All right. Hello, everybody. Oh, wait, let me... Uh, okay. Go away. How's everybody doing? Pop out chat. Make it big. Wait, go away to the what? To, there was like a blue bar that was up here. That oh. was like, hello, you guys, you would like to know stuff. Hello. It was supposed to premiere now. What was supposed to premiere, premiere now? Wait, I'm confused. I don't know. So that's the thing that's been the most confusing with premiering our videos. Yeah. So when we do premiere, it's a video, like a regular vlog that we have pre-recorded the day before that we are premiering live so that Tim can chat with you like in a in a little chat room while the video is going live. Right. But it's not a live video. Right. Because we've gotten comments that are like, this is fake. This isn't even a live video. Right. <laughs> it's like, it's not a live video. It's just the chat is live. But this is a true live show. Ooh, you know what I found out? What? There's uh, in the streaming community, there's this thing called uh, Fs. Like Fs in the chat. Yeah, what is that? What are they for? So from Call of Duty Modern Warfare, uh -huh. there's some cutscene where when you when your your guy gets killed or somebody else gets like killed on the game, it's like press F to send con condolences. Oh. <laughs> and so it's like to pay. Oh, it's press F to pay respect. Oh, okay. And so that's what everybody in the streaming community is kind of like. That's it. We're we're paying our respects to who? To whoever's streaming. Oh, okay, okay. So like, but it's kind of like evolved from there to what? instead of just there's just like a little piece of hair right there. Oh. But instead of see, there's F's in the chat now. But instead <laughs> of uh, yeah, press F, press F to pay respects. Okay. But instead of um, paying respects now, you're like giving props, like, hey everybody, oh. looking cool. Because I was like, I saw it, the last time that we streamed, I saw it, and I was like... You saw somebody push push Fs in the chat? Yeah. Okay. And I was like, what's that? And then, now I know. Now I know. Somebody wants to know what you're drinking? Oh, I'm drinking a watermelon bubbly. And I'm drinking a regular old pure LaCroix. <laughs> Just like a plain old no flavor. As if uh, LaCroix wasn't flavored enough. <laughs> Now it's time for unflavored LaCroix. Oh, somebody asked if we're going to do a food and wine at home. So would that just be like what we did with the flower and garden video? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we could do another one. I feel like first I want to do Animal Kingdom and yeah. I want to do a Universal Day. Yeah. Um, That kind of stuff. There was something else that... Oh, there's a couple of other things in there that I wanted to do too. Yeah. We yeah. have. So here's something that kind of stinks is we had this idea... And we were getting it ready to, um, like, we were trying to get it ready to film this idea. And then Disney we're came like out with it. We planning it out. Yeah, yeah. And then Disney was like, hey, here's what we're doing. And it was the thing that we wanted to do. And I was like, dang it. We yeah. didn't film it in time. So, what same the thing, heck? Same thing with another one, too. Oh, somebody said that I always have watermelon bubbly and that they want to try it. I just, so because we can't um, go to the grocery store right now, we're having all of our groceries delivered. The... You can't find all the flavors of LaCroix. Like, it's hard to find them. And so... Oh, dang. Yeah. That's yeah. what I was saying. There was two ideas now that I've, like... That somebody does... else has done ahead of us. Shoot. Well, I mean, I think we can still do it. It doesn't matter. Yeah. But, um... So, they could, they didn't have all the flavors that we normally get. Like, I love orange LaCroix. Um, but they... You just can't find the flavors that you want. So, this is the one that they had. And I was like, I'll try it. And it's really good. Yeah. Watermelon bubbly is legit. Tim, what happened to your piercings? Uh, a while back, I didn't have a job, and I needed to get a job, and so I was going to interviews, and when I went to the interviews, I just took them out, and then I never asked if it was okay to put them back in when I got the job, so I just kind of like never put them back in. I liked the way that you looked with them, though. They're around somewhere. I can like the holes are still there. You can see yeah. through my ears still. I can put something in there. <laughs> I'll put these. Put these headphones in. No, don't. Plug these headphones into my ear holes. <laughs> I think I can do it. That's gross. Oh, I missed. Um, oh, how are the pickles that we made? They're almost gone. Oh, there They're it is. so good. Stop. No, I'm Joe Rudy. <laughs> you are Joe Rudy. Um, oh, everybody says they love my bow. So in today's live show, we're going to go through um, the ear collection 
Can I show them with this? Yeah. I don't I just take it off. It's cool. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh. This is like like Blue Man Group. It is like Blue Man Group. So here are my ears right here. Some of them. That's so not all. There's more of them. over here. Yeah, there's more by Tim. But so if we're gonna go over my ear collection. Oh no, how do I do it? Just like this? Yeah, you're doing great. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. That's, <laughs> um, yeah, that was perfect. But then I also have these bow bands, which I love because you can wear them just like normal. Like you can't just like go around wearing ears, you know. Like I guess you could, but. They kind of get in the way. So these are from a shop called Rarity by Casey on Etsy or Instagram. You can find her on Instagram. I don't know if she's making ears right now. I think she's only making masks right now. Those you those headbands were hard to get. So she's not open all the time. That's why it's hard to get. So you have to really follow her like her schedule of openings. But right now, I think she's just making masks. So I don't know if you can buy the bow bands right now. But there are tons of shops that make these. This was just the first shop that I saw that made them. Oh, somebody wanted to know where we got the ear band organizer, and that was also from Etsy, but it was a, kind of expensive, and then I had to like redo the hanging, because they hang on the walls. Yeah. And I had to redo the hanging brackets, because they were like not level. Like I put them level on the wall, and it was like hanging crooked, and I was yeah, like, Yeah, hmm. that was kind of a bummer. Like they're made, they're great, I guess, Like they're, but they were super expensive, and they smelled really heavily of paint when they came. Yeah, like of lacquer. Like she didn't, um, like she made them and then just like immediately shipped them out rather than letting them off gas. So, um, but what was the store? I don't remember the name of the store. It says it on the back. Does it? I think it's yeah. display your ears. I think so. Um, like, like other than those few things, they're, they're, they're good. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're they nice. look nice. They hold the ears. Yeah. Oh, we are in the new filming room. Yeah. Yeah, we're in so, the new room. We've got the lights set up, which the lights aren't actually set up for this spot. So you can see we've got like all these like weird shadows behind us. Ooh. Yeah, they're not. Um, happy birthday, Grayson. Oh, somebody asked what my shirt was. It's oh, Coco. It's Coco. This was from Pixar, um, like the, the the place. The animation the, studio. Yeah, Pixar animation <laughs> studio. I was like, uh, how old is Jackson? He is... Four and a half months. Uh, four months, three weeks, I think. Oh, is he almost five months? He's almost five months. Actually, what is today? Yeah, he'll be five months in a couple of days. <gasps> that makes me sad right we gotta like there's there's some things that we need to do <laughs> yeah he's four months three weeks jen you have several mickey ears it's true i do have several, several. <laughs> um how is harry uh -huh. scoots he's doing good i wanted to show him to jackson oh yeah i think that would be really funny especially because he, jackson's now like kind of grabbing at things and i think it would be something that he would grab at yeah so i think so too yeah Hopefully his uh hopefully Harry Scoots' batteries are still. Can you change his batteries out? I'm sure you can. I just haven't looked at it. Watermelon sugar bubbly. Oh, you should yeah. put some sugar in there. I wonder how it would be. No, like Harry. No, I know. Oh. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> okay. put some sugar in there. Our babies are only a week apart. Oh my goodness! Well, wow. happy birthday then. Happy fifth. You're Is either it which way? Yeah, yeah you're either four and a half or you're five months. So happy four and a half or five months. But no orange ears. I have orange ears. No orange bird ears. Oh, no. I don't have any orange bird ears. No. Yeah. I do yeah. have... I have one of these that has little oranges on it that I got because oh, yeah. it was like orange birdie, sort of. How's the bird feeder? The birds hate it. Yeah. Squirrels <laughs> love it. Uh, we did get contacted by a company that makes bird feeders, so we're going to work with them and see if we can get one that works better. And they're really nice. Like They're yeah. like very pretty bird feeders, so I feel like... The neighbors yeah. would be happier with the <laughs> than with <laughs> than with the home building. values are skyrocketing. <laughs> yeah. um, oh, what's your favorite quarantine snack? That's a good question. Oh man, I've been doing bad recently. Pizza. Like, we have pizza for lunch. I made a pizza for lunch. I um, ate like these. <laughs> so, Mike Aiello, who is the one of the creative directors at Universal, his daughter does a fundraiser where they sell popcorn. Oh yeah, and so we bought like, we bought, like, like so a much popcorn. ton of popcorn from them, and we still have some of it. And they have one that's called caramel cheesy, cheesy easy peasy caramel cheesy. Yeah, and it is so good. You wouldn't imagine. It's like what they did is they took caramel corn, like caramel covered popcorn, mm -hmm. and cheese covered popcorn, like Cheeto dust cheese covered popcorn, and put them together. And that sounds so gross. It's really good, but it is. So so good. If you're interested in buying, I think the um, the name of the popcorn is something, something good. good. So good. 
don't something know. good. It's something good is the name of the like something and then the word good is the name of the popcorn yeah. brand. But if you follow him or um, his wife on Twitter, they will tweet out when she's doing the fundraiser and you can buy popcorn from them and it helps her dance troupe. But the popcorn is so good. Like yeah. highly recommend. Ten out of ten. And then uh, I ate some cheez its yesterday. Yesterday was like a it was a cheat day. Like a like a <laughs> one of those days where you're just like I'm gonna eat everything that you can imagine. And we, oh no, is the baby up? Well, look at him. He's just staring at the camera. <laughs> you guys want to see a creepy baby? Oh, just, oh no! I didn't. Oh okay, hold on. What happened? I I dropped the. He's he's not being creepy anymore. He's just like. I don't know if you can see him. Oh, he's, he's wiggling now. His little wiggly butt. Is he back asleep? No. He's just staring off. Well, he might there go he back to sleep. Can you see him? Oh, no. He looked back the other way. When he stares at the camera, it's really creepy. It's like a... Because his eyes are like black in this because it's like a black and white camera. Yeah. And so it looks like a demon. Do you want to see if... <laughs> uh, you want me to go grab him? We'll see if he'll take a pacifier. Because he seems like he might go back to sleep because he's staring off to the side like that. Okay. All right, I'll be right back. Yeah. Also, I know that I ask this all the time. What? Uh, how do we sound? <laughs> I'm oh, always, yeah. We're using a different microphone. Always trying to do a different uh, microphone because the, the lavaliers are great. But this is so much easier. And so, I don't know. What do you guys think? Double Good. That is the name of the company. That's what, it's, what, ba what brand? Baby Monitor? Oofy? E-U-F-Y? Effy? Oofy? I don't know. I think that's what it is. Uh, the sound is good. Okay, awesome. That's really good because this was very easy. And I like that better. All right, excellent. Sweet. Thank you guys so much. Toast the ghost. Um, yeah. Sounds like you're in an empty room. We kind of are. There is there is furniture in here, but there's not a lot. And there's nothing up on the walls yet. So there's like, it's probably very echoey. I think eventually what I want to do is I want to get some like baffling, some like sound things to put them on the walls to make it a little bit like deader sounding in here but coffee order i haven't hey baby hey baby hello baby he's he would, awake yeah he wouldn't take a bath fire how you doing buddy what's going on what's this what do you see he liked it he was looking at it he looked at the sign oh that little bit i might actually take this down okay well he's sitting oh yeah because it's not attached to the wall yeah tomato land Tomato land. Hi. What do you think, buddy? How was your nap? Yeah, acoustic panels. That's what I think we're going to do that eventually. But I got iguana with a hollow wig. We still haven't gotten the Harry Styles shirt. Oh, no, we need to do that. Dang oh, it. Oh, dang. Oh, can you show us the ears? Yes, we need to get to the ear collection. So. A bit of back fuzz in the audio. I think that's just the uh, all of the computers running around it. Oh, the like the fans, the fans and stuff. Yeah, because I've got two computers running right now. Also, there's a monitor right behind it, so it could be that. <laughs> um, okay, so I want to show you guys my favorite pair of ears, and I hate to say that I have a favorite pair, but I do have a favorite pair. So this pair was sent in. Oh, and I should also preface this by saying I don't know the names of every single shop that sent me ears, so I'm gonna tell you the names of the ones that I do know. But if I don't know, I just I'm sorry, I don't know. Um, maybe they can oh. leave comments. What? I forgot the cuppy cake song. I don't oh. remember it anymore. Oh, how does it go? You're my sugar pie honey bunch. Cuppy uppy up, up cakes. You're my sweetie pie. You're my scum little yum. Snug and Yeah. You're the apple <laughs> of my eye. And I love you so, and I want you to know that I'll always be right here. Right here! Because I love to sing sweet songs to you, because you are so dear. That was most of it, right? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> um, okay, so I, um, okay, so I'm going to go over the, the um, ears now. 
And I don't know which shop sent every single pair of ears, so if I don't know the name of the shop, I'm just gonna show you the ears. But if I do know the name of the shop, I will name them. But I don't know very many of them. So, um, oh, oh, Jessie said that the Cuppy Cake song is her ringtone for her son. Oh. I love that. Uh, so. Like us singing it? Oh, no. That sounds terrible. Was that Kirky? I think Kirky said that picking a favorite pair of ears is like picking a favorite child. Oh. I can pick a favorite child. It's Jackson. <laughs> what about me? Um, um, so, really quick. This is my favorite pair of ears. I hate to say that it's my favorite, Oh, but it is my favorite. Leg Life says they want to send us a pair of cruise ears, but don't, don't oh worry goodness. about it. We... So, okay, speaking of Leg Life, um, we actually, so the video that we're filming today was inspired by you guys. Yeah. And um, I'm so happy that you're here because we can tell you guys. We'll be um, shouting out your video in the video that we make and we'll link it and make sure everybody um, checks it out, hopefully. But they made a video, I want to say last week or a week ago or could have been a month ago now I, honestly time like what is time i don't know but they made a video where they were talking about like their things that made them happy yeah and so we were like because we did a video where we talked about um the theme parks what like the what kind of restrictions would be at the theme parks when they open again yeah so and it was like it we didn't think that we were being negative. Well, it's not. I think it was just the the nature of the yeah, video. It was a it's negative. It's not, not a happy subject of being right. like, things aren't going to be the way they used to be. But I think that's just like, that's just reality. And that's so, quarantine, baby. <laughs> I think it is. <laughs> and so a lot of people left comments that were like, I usually really love your videos, but this one really made me depressed. We got so many comments that were like, I'm depressed now. I'm depressed now. So we wanted to make... A video that was more about like happy things and about things that made us happy and things that um, were not depressing or negative. And Leg Life, uh, the, the Leg Life channel made this video that was like things that made us happy this week. And I was like, yeah, I like that idea where I would also like to talk about things that made us happy. Yeah. So um, I just wanted to just say that we we got the idea from them and that you guys should check out their video and I'll be linking their video in our video. And I'll be saying this again in our video. Oh, but Lee says that he's getting a blurry video. He is? is anybody else? Everything on my end looks like it's doing good. I've got zero dropped frames, which is exciting. I don't know what that means. I don't either. But, um, yeah. So wait. Oh, and also it's Adam's birthday. Who these are? Both Lee and Adam are people that come to all of our live shows and watch all of our videos and stuff. So happy birthday, guys! Yeah. Um, that's quarantine, baby. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh no. Not blurry. All right. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Uh, we love Lee. them too. Somebody said, I love like life. We love them too. So we, um, oh gosh. Not blurry. It's clear. It's clear. Yeah, yeah. So. It went so fast. Everything is fine. Okay. That's good. So really quick. This is, um, my favorite pair of ears. I love Marie. Marie is one of the, um, like my is my favorite character. She's, She's from, from the Aristocats. Yeah, they have so, like a, a what are those things called? Like a animation cell from the Aristocats. Somebody, the over there? somebody asked when we showed the video where we yesterday's video where we showed this room. Yeah. Are you still so tired? Look at this baby yawning. <laughs> um, somebody asked where we got that, and that was actually mailed to no, us. No, no, that's by from one. Mike. That's not from Mike. Is it not? No, Mike gave us the. It's downstairs. Oh. Yeah, this was mailed to us from somebody. Gotcha. Yeah, Mike gave us a. Um, like a, what do you call it? Where it's like a, a plastic, I'll have to show you guys in a video. Oh, it's not framed. No, it's not framed. It's like okay. in a, it's in a that's paper. A, that's what this is too. This is not slow mode. It is slow mode. Isn't that crazy? We have it on 20 seconds. Like, um, We are going to put Jackson in the logo for sure. It's just going to take uh, some time because we're, we have other things going on, <laughs> but it will happen. So, um, so this is from... Modern Mouse Boutique on Etsy and on Instagram if you want to check them out. They are also making masks right now, but they um, this is just like an awesome pair of ears. I love them. I think they did such a great job. And their autofocus is doing things strangely on occasion. Yeah, that's this camera. I've been working on using the better camera, but everything is sold out right now as far as doing HDMI to The couch USB is what's in focus. Input. <laughs> oh, no. That's because I, whenever I bring Jackson up, it tries to like focus on him too. Gotcha. Um, so yeah, I'm working on it. So far, I can do it. 
but the audio is off without the special little uh, like HDMI grabber. Oh. So, and because those are all sold out. Hi. Okay, so favorite pair of ears. Love these. Here's a close up look. I don't know if I can do a close up look. Will it let me? Eh, it might. You never know. Here's what they look like. They're kind of, they have like a felt little pink ear part. They have the little tail um, or the little hair tuft, which I love. I just think these are really great. I love them so much. They're lightweight. It's wonderful. Okay. Oh, Jackson's trying to type stuff on the computer. <gasps> you are. Everyone focuses on Jackson when he comes into phrase. <laughs> Um, okay, then I also have some from We've Got Ears, who I also love. This is a, a really great shop. That It was actually one of the first shops that sent me ears, and um, she just does a really great job. She was, I don't know if she still lives in Texas, but she was living in Texas, and she would put the ears in her car to make sure that they could withstand the heat. Yeah. So she, like, te weather tested the ears, which I thought was really cool, right. because in Florida it's very hot. So um, I thought that was nice, but these are my in and out like burger and french fry ears. I don't know if you guys can see them, but I love burgers and french fries. Can um, you uh, hold him for one second? Yeah. I need to, this computer that's on my lap is like heating up and it's making me hot. Buddy. Too hot in the hot tub. <laughs> oh, somebody made Pokemon ears. Oh, how many did they make? Your old vlog got made me get the Pandora Blacklight ears. Oh, I have those here, so I'll show you guys those. Um, if you guys want to see those. Okay. Wow, that was that computer was getting hot. Also, first, all these lights in here. Oh, Steve asks, what is your first date night? Like, where are we going to eat for our first date night out? That's a good question. I mean, it does, like, kind of depend on what's open. Yeah. Really. Well, um... I think it depends on like when, I don't know, it depends on a lot of stuff, I think. I would like to uh, go to Bull and Bear. Oh, back to the Marie frame, where is it from? I think it's from, um, just somebody mailed it in to us. I, I don't, I think it was just somebody had it in their collection and then gave it to me. Buddy. Yeah, I think so. Your birthday's on Saturday, happy birthday. Should we show that Marie thing? We should, but first, um, we can show it at the end. Is that okay? Yeah. So these are the Pandora Blacklight ears, and they're so cool. They have the little, like, um, hair thing, the little hair tail, and then it also, I don't know if you can see, but there's, like, a little glitter kind of stuff on here, and that reacts to the blacklight. Yeah, it's like glow-in-the-dark paint. Yeah, and they're so cool in Pandora because they react to the blacklight. And so you have your little... A little hair piece. I don't know. I think these are just really pretty. So these are also from We've Got Ears. I love them. Another set. So she's actually made me several pairs. So I'm just going to go through all of hers really quick. Another set that she made were these um, DCA ears. Uh-oh. I can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> um, but, oh, and this changed. Yeah, it's not <gasps> Pixar Pier anymore. Oh my goodness, I totally forgot. Or, or, does it still say Paradise Pier? I don't know. Or does it say Pixar Pier now? There's, um, they say Paradise Pier and then the Mickey Fun Wheel. And then the back is blue. But, um, oh, that's so funny. So these are like a collector's item now. Oh yeah. And then she also made me these, which I thought were so neat. They are the Splash Mountain ears. Pretty good, sure as you're born. And they have the little, like, handkerchief. I don't know what you call that thing. We call that a... What do you call that? It's like when in old-timey shows when the people would run away and they would have this little, like, knapsack on a stick. Yeah, it has a name. I don't know. And then it says, um, everything is satisfactual on the back. Yeah, it's actual. And it has the little briar patch. What are those things called? I don't know, but that's what it looks like. A, a binny? Is that what it is? Is that... I feel like I want to say binny something. And then she also made these Matterhorn ears for me, which are also super fun. A knapsack? I don't know if... Is it called a knapsack? So Hobo it, stick. That makes sense. Oh, no. What's he pulling at? The chair. He's, oh. like, looking at his monitor. Oh, is he? He's like, where's yeah. the baby? Um, and so when I wore these, the first time that we went to Disneyland, 
I wore these and the people at the Matterhorn were like, oh my gosh, I've never seen Matterhorn ears. A bindle. A that's what bindle. I was thinking of. A bindle. Gotcha. I think that's like the correct terminology for it. A bindle. Why did they do that? Why did they put it on a stick? So that they could hold so it. So it was easier? It's like a lever. Okay. Yeah. Um, the next pair that We've Got Ears sent me, I'm sorry, she oh. sent me so many ears, so these are all going to be from the We've Got Ears shop. Um, so here's the other thing. If you make ears, the thing, the reason why I know that these are all hers is because she has a very specific style, so I, I can recognize the style of ears, but also she puts the name on the inside of the headband. So that makes it really easy if somebody's like, who's, who makes these ears? You, they, like, I'll never forget because it's right there. So just as like a tip for anybody. But these are the Magic Kingdom ears, and they have Cinderella Castle. Why can't I? Am I doing, doing it? great. Am I doing it wrong? Because it's like backwards. And then they also have some beautiful Mickey balloons. Same thing on the back. But I love these. They're so cute. A bundle. A bundle? Hobo bundle. Somebody <laughs> said Spark Cam. What's Is that? that Something that we can use to to do the, the DSLR camera? I don't know. Let's see. Hello from Italy. A rucksack. What's a rucksack? That's just like a German backpack. Oh, okay. Right? I love them with the castle too. Um, these are the pair of Epcot ears that she sent over. So these are Spaceship Earth. Sparco Cam. I'll have to look that up. I love these too. These the thing I like the most about her ears is that they're lightweight and the band is kind of thick. So it's very comfortable. It's not it doesn't push down on your ears. Which is nice. Do you wear a different pair every time you go to the parks? You know I don't actually. I have so many ears that I've probably never even worn. The ones that I wear the most are my Marie ears. Um just because I love those a lot. Um she also sent me these Lion King ears, which I love. So on the front, you have um, little Simba and little Nala. And Ooh. then on the back, was that him? He just farted on me. <laughs> and then on the back, you have adult Simba and adult Nala. And then this cute little Lion King print. What is stinky fart? Buddy. And then the um, bow is made of like a burlap sack, which I love. I thought that was really pretty. Well, somebody said they like our shadows. Because they're like in between us. Oh yeah, that's weird. Next to each other. That's super strange. Yeah. Or is that just two of my shadows? No, that's yours too. Oh, he's farting again. Buddy. Still farting. What's going on? What did you eat? Tell your kids to be quiet. Be quiet, Jackson. Oh no. And I think the last pair that she sent over was these retro Epcot ears, which I love so much. These are so adorable. Um, I just, these are awesome. I love them. I like how blue they are. That's cool. Yeah, they're very pretty. Uh, does Tim own any ears? No, I own a couple of ear hats. Oh, yeah. But I don't really wear them. No, I feel like you don't like stuff on your head anymore. You used you to wear a hat. I used hat. to wear a hat all the time. Yeah. But now I don't like stuff on my head. Um, <laughs> somebody said <laughs> something that I was going to say. <laughs> but now I don't remember what it is. What? Jackson has to learn to blame the dog. Oh, no. Oh, somebody asked if... Oh, said Tim is giving me very serial killer vibes today. Why? Right. I don't know. <laughs> what does that mean? It's very strange. Uh, if the ears have a back and a front, can you adjust the bow? No, they both stay in the same place. So that's it is like the front is the front and the back is the back, unfortunately. But that is a really good idea. Uh, what does my necklace say? It says Jackson's name in Morse code. How is the G7X Mark III performing? We haven't used that camera since D23. It just didn't do well. Yeah. It just I feel like it was a waste of a purchase. It was. Which stinks because it was like a $700 camera. Yeah, and it also stinks too because I thought like we could use it to live stream because you can live stream straight from it. Mm -hmm. And I've been trying to get it worked for the past work for I've been trying to get it to work for the past like week and it just doesn't work. It just keeps giving me an error. Error 127, error 127, and it never tells me. Like, I can look on the internet all day long, and it never says what the error, what the error is. What the heck? I guess I have to call Canon, I think. Hello. Hi. I love you. <laughs> um, so these ears are the Jungle Cruise ears, and they are 
one of my also one of my favorite pairs because they're super lightweight and they are really cool. I just I love that the actual ear part is made of rope. And the bow is like a like a burlapy type ribbon. And then it has like the fake ferns. And now these are made from Minion Company is the name of the shop that makes these. And she makes the same pair that have like little tiny Christmas lights. And they're Jingle Cruise ears. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, they're so fun. Do the little tiny Christmas lights light up or are they just I don't, colored? I think they're just colored. I'm not sure if they light up. Because I don't have a pair, so I don't know. <laughs> The camera's trying to autofocus on Jackson. Is it? Hey, I'm sorry. Buddy. He's just having fun. Well, he like he loves to be he loves wiggling to around. bounce up and down. <laughs> oh, um, the new Joe Rody ears. They sold out within seconds because we found out because of bots. I feel like it's just not fair. Yeah, it isn't. I didn't want to buy them personally. They weren't my style, but um <laughs> I know a lot of other people really did want to get them, and they couldn't because of the bots. Yeah, the bots bought them, and now they're on mm -hmm. eBay for like 350 bucks. Which is crazy. Yeah, because they were $80. Which is... Buddy. Still farting on you guys. Why do you have so many farts today? That's that's what the F in the chat is for. For, for farts. farts. <laughs> um, oh, where can you get this necklace? I don't know. Amazon. I got it on Amazon. Do you remember the name of the shop? No, I just typed in Morse code necklace. So in the next home vlog, what we'll do is we'll show you, because um, I have the box from it still, so I'll show you the box. I love his squeaky noises too. Oh, Bandit's downstairs, but he is sleeping right now. Yeah, it's been rainy and thundery all day, so Bandit's been like, Hi. Hi. like trying to avoid everything <laughs> all, at all costs. What's for supper tonight? I think we're going to have Enchiladas. enchilada chicken with yeah. um, rice. Buddy. Yeah. Are you looking at my ears? Is that what it is? Do you think they're so cool? <laughs> yeah. Um, Jackson did not eat the sweet beans. Is Happily Ever After actually live tonight? Yes. There, I read some stuff about people um, hearing them doing testing the other day. Yeah. So I think they're going to be on the live stream. I think they're going to be on Facebook or okay. uh, Instagram. Instagram, okay. Instagram Live, I think so. Hopefully we'll be able to catch it and watch it. Yeah, look for Disney Parks Instagram, I think is what it is, Disney Parks. What pair is the most comfortable? Um, honestly, the ears from this shop from um, Minion Company are the most comfortable because they're very lightweight. So she actually made me a few pairs too. So Minnie and Company made me this pair, which I also love so much. They're um, Polynesian princess ears. Oh. So they're supposed to be modeled after the Polynesian resort, but they also have this cool wire crown. So I'm like a... What happened? Bud. Hello. Oh, no. <laughs> He's, um, and then the ears are made of like a wood. Let me see if I can show you. They're like a wooden... Yeah. But they're just so super cute. I love these. They're so pretty. And they remind me a lot of um, Hawaii. Man, people are really talking about how I, I cut my beard in the chat. Do they not like it? People are saying it's too short. It needs to be grown back out. Really? I like it. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, it, it will grow back, so it's, it's A-OK. -okay. Do a live stream with crispy s'mores. I don't know how we could do a live stream with them. We can. Can you? Yeah. You like add like two screens? Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe we'll try to do that one day. Yeah. Um, so somebody said those would be good for Flower and Garden Festival. So these, she actually made these for Flower and Garden Festival for me. So these are from a um, minion company as well. Somebody said Aulani. Uh, ears and we have some Alani ears that we were we bought to give away. So we're gonna do a giveaway. I just need to figure out how we can mail the items without going to the post office. Yeah. Because we need to not we we need to stay indoors. Um. So as soon as we can figure that out, we'll do our giveaway. So. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, Look at how angry he looks right now. He's like, I'm angry. I'm sorry, buddy. And so these serial killer vibes. Stop. <laughs> So these are the, um, what's the fall festival? Is that food and wine? Yeah. So these are like the food and wine ones that she made me. And the actual ear part are like a, like a, a wire, wire, but they're like a gold, maybe not really gold, but a gold colored wire. Is that the back? 
<laughs> it can be, these are reversible. Oh, that's fun. So I think I like the side without the big flower. This side. Jackson yeah. is very vocal. This is what he does. Listen to Jackson. It says you can do a post office pickup and they'll come to you to pick it up. Oh, okay. Maybe we'll do that. So as soon as we can figure that out. Um, I think we, we need to also be able to weigh it though. We don't have a scale. Oh, that's true. We just estimate. It's like, eh, this feels like. We can do like we do with Jackson where I hold it and then weigh myself and then weigh myself again. Yeah, maybe we can do that. We'll see. But yeah, as soon as we can um, figure that out, we'll definitely do. Everybody's saying package pickup. We're going to look into that because if we can do that, we will. Oh, would you rather go to Alani or go on a Disney cruise? Um, somebody was asking if I can link the shops. I can't link the shops in the live show. I can't. I can't link the shops in the live show, but I'm, I'm telling you the names of the shops so that you can go and find them on your own if you want. In case you guys are wondering, that's why I shaved. Because <laughs> like, he, like, grabs so He grabs. Much. Um, but these are from Minnie and Company on Etsy and on Instagram. So, so far I've showed you ears from Modern Mouse Boutique, which were the... Um, the uh marie ears that i love so much that's they're on instagram and then i showed you we've got ears they're on instagram and then minnie and company they're on instagram oh somebody oh darn it i missed it there was a there was a, 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 a cheap scale off of amazon oh okay or do flat rates somebody loves jackson's pjs these are little pelican pjs yeah jackson's doing his own live chat he really is so this is my next favorite pair of ears. These are, I don't know who these are from. This is the first one that I don't know the name of the shop, but I love these so much. They are the Flower and Garden ears. Buddy. Oh, yeah, he is hungry. Is he? What time is it? Uh, two. Two o'clock? Yeah. Okay. Do you want to feed him real quick and I'll just like... Uh, well, I, I feel like I can feed him because this isn't, this isn't pointed up. Yeah, whatever you want to do. Do you think that's a bad idea? No, I'm sure it's fine. Okay. Do you want me to go get you the cover or anything? Or you just want to... Yeah, will you get me the cover? Yeah. Okay. <gasps> Buddy, you're going to get some lunch. Okay. Um, first class postage, use a kitchen scale. Okay. We don't even have a kitchen scale. Well, <laughs> I feel like we can find a kitchen scale online. Yeah. How many ears do you have? I have a hundred pairs of ears. He does have a lot to say. Oh my goodness, yeah, I know, we're gonna eat some lunch. We are, my favorite cocktail on property, so when I was drinking, my favorite cocktail was actually at Nomad Lounge. Oh buddy, hold on, hold on. <laughs> and it was the watermelon, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did you find it? Yeah. Okay. Oh no. Um, it's the watermelon drink, watermelon high tower, I think it's called, at um, Nomad Lounge, and it's so delicious. Watermelon high tower. Yeah, my favorite. Whoa. Okay, will you take him for me? Yeah. He's just like eating on your shoulder. Yeah, he's my hungry hey. boy. So somebody asked if they thought that. Did we think that Jackson's eyes would stay blue? We are hoping that just because they're so darn cute. But, um, I feel like yes. How often does Jackson feed a day? Um, hey, you okay? It's coming, it's coming, buddy. Buddy, okay. I don't know. That's a good question. Whenever he, which side? This side, right? What? Here, let me take him. Oh, my buddy. Hold on. Will you help me? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. So, how's everybody doing? When Jackson's older, would you go back to Japan? Very much so. We were planning a trip to go back before all of this happened, and then all this happened, so we couldn't go. Yeah. But, yes. Um. A <laughs> hundred pairs of ears. I guess you could say you're all ears. That's true. What oh, yeah. brand of high chair did you get? We got a oh, gray coat. Well, yeah, a lot of people were asking about the um, the high chair, and I didn't even think to link it. I just because we were just showing you how cute it was, like his reaction to it. Yeah. But it, um, yeah, it's a gray coat. 
I don't know, six and one or something like that. It oh. has, yeah, we'll, we'll, if you come back to this video after, like maybe like 20 minutes after the live show's done, it'll oh, be wait. in the description. Somebody said they, their, their son, or did it say son? I don't know what it said. Their, I stayed blue for the longest time, so they thought they were safe, and then I couldn't read the rest. Oh, do you want me to look here? Yeah, I want to read it. Uh, read some other ones and I'll find it. Okay. We didn't eat all the pickles yet, but they're almost gone. Oh, it just says, but they changed color. Did they? When? When did they change color? Oh, Bridget. Yes, I still do recommend the G7X Mark II. That's what we've actually been filming all of our home vlogs with. And the Focus does go in and out every once in a while. And, like, so here's the thing. For Focus, I prefer Sony. Do we have a Sony a6600 that is awesome with Focus? But it's so big, the it's G7X is like this little tiny thing that you're just like, woo, I'm filming on my G7X. And you can just like do things fast. But then it doesn't uh, doesn't focus as good. Um, somebody asked if we're going to still do a baby item review. And I would like to do that. Yeah. there Because there are things that we definitely like super love. What did yeah. it say? Graco Bloom High Chair. Oh, there you go. Cool. That's what it's called. After a year, they went from green to brown. Really? That's weird. That's interesting. See, somebody told me that if they're if his eyes are blue after six months, that they'll be blue forever. But I guess that's not true. My son's eyes changed color at the age of two. Wow. I wonder what like why, like why that happens. I don't know. Changed to brown at nine months. Was it like a slow change or was it just like? Yeah, I wonder if it's something that we'll we'll notice or is it something that you just don't notice. Um, somebody said, I think it was Grayson said that they were ordering merch from our site right now. Um, oh. we just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for doing that. Thank you. Baby's eyes change around four months. His eyes are pretty blue, so they might not. Yeah. So my dad's eyes are blue. Your dad's eyes are blue. Yeah. So that's why we were thinking that he would have blue eyes. Well, and my eyes are like lighter. They're not blue. Oh, buddy, buddy. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> he goes, <clears throat> Are you okay? Too many milkies? Uh, what's the next project on the house? Putting shelves up here, actually. Yeah, I want to finish this room. And then they can uh, change you were, color pretty late. Wow. You were not here, but we were talking uh, oh, with the chat. I want to put up some like sound dampening things. Oh yeah, on think, various walls. I think we need it. Yeah. Depends on how blue. Yeah, his eyes aren't like super light, so I don't know. They're pretty light. I've seen like lighter eyes on babies though. Right. Um, no, I don't have blue eyes. I have hazel eyes, so they're kind of like greenish. Uh, somebody um, said hair color. Oh, thank you. Somebody said that I'm an inspiration. Oh. Thank you. I like how he's like, yeah. it's like a little monster in there. He is. Uh, have you guys ever seen the video of the lady that's feeding her kid and then she's like eating a cookie and then you just see this hand come up and grab the cookie from her? <laughs> so funny. Yeah, that's going to be him. Did you see the helicopter video? Is that the one from Disneyland? Mm -hmm. I didn't... Uh, oh, Philip, glad to see you're in here. Oh, yeah. Hello. And glad you are feeling better, too. We are so happy that you're feeling better. Uh, there's only a 25% chance they will stay blue. Oh, dang. Wow. Tim does look younger with a trim beard. Thank you. Oh, it says, but brown is dominant, so they'll likely change. Yeah, that's what I figured, because like my eyes are brown, and my mom's eyes are brown, and your mom's eyes are brown. Yeah. I don't know. Mm. We, like we will love him no matter what no of course but <laughs> yeah. it's just interesting to like know what's going on you know what are you doing what is most likely they could stay blue i like that we're getting all kinds of i know like stuff all over the place you both have recessive genes for blue eyes so he has a good chance and i can't read the rest oh buddy um can you sell slogan caps what do you mean we don't have i don't i don't think we have the option for hats on our site do we we had it was we were only able to do like trucker hats and I didn't like that so I didn't. I wanted to do like a dad hat with uh, oh, that'd be fun. with bandit on it, but um, we needed to find a company that would do the embroidering, and then we would have to sell those separately. Like we would have to mail them out, and that just wasn't something we could do. Um, are they doing our yard right now? Is this just what happens? It's like pouring outside. Every time that we go live, <laughs> they do our our yard or somebody's yard. Are you done? Um, was that it? Are you all full? Well, he's like, he's, his little arms are going crazy. <laughs> yes. Um, what is Orlando like in January? That To depends. be honest, yeah, it's hard to tell. 
Mad Libs merch. Yeah. Toast oh, the Ghost. Oh, I think we should do that. How do we come up with the name Jackson? So we we originally wanted to name him Jack, and then I just wasn't sure that if Jack was a good name for like a little baby. Um, so we're like, how can we use that as like a nickname, but give him a, a longer name? And yeah. so we, we both really like the name Jackson, and then we can still call him Jack later. Uh, oh, do you want to try and make your own ears? Yeah. I do. That was something we wanted to do for a video, just as like a fun Disney at home day. Um, but we, it's hard to find things um, like the, the um, what do you call it? Like the supplies are kind of hard to find. Yeah. Somebody asked if he tried. Take him and try to burp him? Yeah, I think he might need a burp. Somebody asked if we, um, if he crawled, tried to crawl again and he did today. He yeah. Actually, he almost did crawl today. It he was like so crazy. He like moved today. You know what I mean? Will you do more podcasts? So we were supposed to record a podcast last night, and we um, we ended up not being able to do it because of the baby. So we are going to, though. We are going to. Oh, he's got his finger inside of my ear. Oh, no. <laughs> um, what do you think of all the reports of there it is. Disney not opening until 2021? There you are. I honestly, like, I kind of had a feeling that that would be the case. Did you have so many burpees? Was oh, that a big boy burp? Oh. So of course we're going to be very sad, you know, if we can't go to Disney until 2021. But if that's the safest way to do it, then that's just how we have to do it. Yeah. We watch every day. Has quarantine been stressful for you guys? Yeah. I mean. I think so. It, I, I think it's. It's. It, yes. <laughs> it's, I think it's been stressful in the fact that we. That Jackson is so little um, that we're stuck in the house. We can't go anywhere. Like we can, we can go around our neighborhood. So we, we, but we haven't really been doing that lately. No. But we could like take him on a walk around the neighborhood. Um, we can go outside in the backyard. We can go swimming and stuff like that. Although it has been really rainy lately, so we yeah, haven't it's been, been raining able to... really bad a lot. Yeah. So no swimming lately. But um, I think just the fact that we can't leave has been really stressful. Yeah. What did you do to increase your milk supply? Um, actually, we got a comment from somebody in the comments that said that I should take sunflower lecithin. Yeah. And that helped. That was great. It's interesting because what sunflower lecithin does is it doesn't increase your milk supply, but it makes your milk... It like thins out your milk. Yeah. It makes it flow better. Yeah. And ever since I started doing the lecithin, I've noticed we I've been yeah because he's been getting more yeah I've been producing way more milk and I eat oatmeal every day and that's another food that's supposed to help with your milk production we need more pool vlogs I, oh, yeah. I agree I would love to be in the pool right now but it's super rainy yeah. so the next time that we have like a, a nice warm sunny day we'll we'll get in the pool huh. um send your storm down to Naples I feel like that's probably where it's going Somebody said my head looks like it's a different shape from this angle. Really? What does it look like? I think it looks normal. <laughs> There's just like uh -huh. shadows on it because of the baby and stuff. Oh, gotcha. Um, okay, so more ears. Let's see. What's the next pair? This is a fun pair that my friend Kaylee made. They're kind of like on the bigger side, but they're fun. I can't see how they look right now. Oh, yeah. Sorry, because I pulled this away. <laughs> can you see? I can. How do they look? Ooh, They're like big own. sunflower ears. <gasps> Jackson, what do you think? Those are big ears. <laughs> what do you think? They are very big, but they're so cute. Like if you love sunflowers. More Lego build videos. You know what happened the other day? <gasps> yeah, tell them. Somebody sent me a link and they're like, check this out. Like really cheap Legos. And I went to the link and I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> Like, there, it was like a clearance sale. They're like, we're having a clearance on Lego sales for the next, like, 10 hours. And I was looking at it, and I was like, oh, man, we can get the Hogwarts cas castle for, like, $34. And I was like, wait a second. This seems, like, too good to be true. Yeah, it did. And so I looked it up, and there was this huge Reddit thread about it. And apparently it's a huge scam, this website is, and it keeps popping up in Facebook ads as, like, different websites. And what happens is... You pay them mm. for, oh, look at that. You, you love them? You pay them for the Legos, 
and they just never send you the Legos, or if they send you something, they send you like a knockoff yeah. scarf, like a Gucci scarf or oh, a Hermes yeah. scarf, and they're just like, man, they'll probably think that this is okay. Because you feel like you're getting a better deal by getting the Gucci item than by getting like the Lego set. Yeah. But it's it's a scam, so don't. Yeah, these are these are pretty heavy, um, but they are flower and garden, so they're they're very pretty. Yeah, they're fun. They are fun, and so the actual ear itself is it's like a little mini wreath. Yeah, they're like little wreaths. Ooh, hold on, let me see if I can show you. So they're kind of thick. They have little butterflies for the butterfly garden. There's flowers on the back. Um, they're very pretty, and I can't remember who made these ears. Oh, the scam is also on Instagram. Be careful. Is it? Ooh. What the heck? The audacity. And then we also have... Somebody made me a pair of slinky dog ears, and I can't... I don't know what shop this was either. I'm very sorry. But they're um, pretty legit looking. Has Tim sorted out Twitch yet? No. No. I haven't even looked into it at all. I was just like interested oh you yawning again my little buddy um um volcano bay at home from the pool so we had an idea to do a water park day at home we just have to wait for the weather to be better Giggle. will you ever enclose the pool what does that mean Our pool it is, is it is has enclosed. a screen enclosure around yeah there. or maybe they mean um like put it inside no, like like the the fence, you know, the the baby fence. Oh, we have a baby fence for yeah, it. Yeah, we do. Do we have any <laughs> horror night ears? I don't have any horror night ears. Somebody said that. Oh, there's a scam similar to Ray Ban glasses, but somebody said that those ears remind them of Midsummer. These? No, the other oh, ones. Oh, the other ones? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't see that movie, no, but I, I wouldn't let her watch it. <laughs> I watched it. Which it wasn't that. It's not like really a scary movie, but there was definitely some scenes where you're like, oh my. You can get cheap Lego from AliExpress. It's off-brand, but they're decent. That sounds interesting. So this pair of ears is from oh. Sally's Enchanting Ears. And she does really great work. She's um, Her ears are like very well made. And these are the ticket books. So if you guys remember when Disney first opened, oh. you didn't buy like... You bought a ticket into the park, but then you also had to buy tickets to the rides. And they would have like... A ticket, B ticket, C ticket, D ticket, E tickets, depending on um, how like the thrill factor of the rides were. So she found, I guess, a print that was of the ticket books. And I thought these ears were so cool. And then there's the back. Somebody asked if we had any baby onesies. Oh, for like on our shop? We do. Yeah. Yeah. Best fireworks show in Orlando. Happily ever after. I think so, yeah. Yeah. Um, but so, yeah, so these are from Sally's Enchanting Ears. And she sent me some other pairs of ears. I don't know if they're in this set. They might be downstairs. Um, they might be over there. I'm not sure. But she um, does a really great job. I love her ears. Make a baby proofing the house video, please. I don't know. Because most of it we've already done. Like, we've yeah. already... We've already Secured all of the furniture to the walls and mm -hmm. like the paintings and stuff are secured to the walls The only thing that we need to do is just the outlets and the um, kitchen cabinets. Yeah, the cabinets and that's it Yeah. Off-brand Lego are not good. They don't click together. Oh Hmm. I don't so I do have some ears from Japan. Can you grab them from over there? I don't Which know. ones are they? My um, Shelly Mae ones. Are they here? Oh, yeah, they're there. Someone asked if we love or hate olives. I love olives. These are the only ears that I bought from Japan other than um, the headbands, which I don't have. <laughs> Buddy, what are you doing? <laughs> I don't have them up here, the headbands, but I'll have to show you in the next because I don't think we're going to get through all the ears today. <laughs> Buddy. Oh, no. Do you want to wear them? I don't think we're going to get through all the ears today, so I'll show you the, the bands in the next one. But these are my Shelly May ears. Oh, if so, you had to pick one, Tigress or Mako, Mako. That'd be easy. Target has Steamboat Willie and Lego for $90. I think that's... Oh, we could get 5% off with our Target card. Oh. That's pretty good. That's a good idea, yeah. I'd stick to Lego and pay the extra money. Yeah, I think you're right. 
do you guys do scrapbooking? I did make a scrapbook one time. It was hard. Would you recommend Tokyo Disney? Yes. Yes. Very much so. Do you have any baby photos to compare to Jackson? We actually do, and I feel like we'll do that again now that he's a little bit older. Mm -hmm. Because the pictures that we showed were, we were a little bit older. Yeah. So we'll, I feel like we'll do a side-by-side -side and let you guys tell us what you think, um, who he looks like more. Who do you look like? Do you look like your mom or your dad? Who? Which one? He's like... <laughs> But we have to do this. Yeah. <laughs> now what does he look like? <laughs> Tokyo or Disneyland? Tokyo. Oh, Tokyo for sure. Disneyland is my number two, though. Why don't you guys ride Rip Ride Rocket more often? Because it uh, scares me. That and it's, uh, I, I don't, I don't know. I, tr I can't ride stuff at Universal because I can't film it as much. And it's like, also the, um, the metal detectors. I don't like to take my stuff out of my pockets. Oh yeah. And put it in a locker and then go get it afterwards. Well, and the line's it's like always to, like, long. Go on the ride. Somebody asked me if Disney ears are more comfortable or if Etsy ears are more comfortable. And I would have to say for the most part the Etsy ears are more comfortable because they're lighter and they don't pinch behind your ears like the Disney ones do. Um but I do love the Disney branded ears as well because they make cute ones. Oh, everybody says he looks like you. Oh, you look he like your mom. Exactly like you. Do you look like your mom? You do. Bite that nose. No. Bite that no, nose. Bite my nose. Um, so these ears, I don't know the name of the shop that made these ears, but I love these ears so much. They're like '90s splatter paint. I don't know if you can see oh, that's them. Fun. And then the bow is like mesh, and they are also so light. Like, look how thin they are. They're so super light. And I love that they're put together with um, little stitching. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Oh, yeah, you can kind of see it across the bottom there. But I love that about them. I think these are so cute. I think, but I don't know for sure, I think this is from a brand called Disney Darlings. I think. Because I also got these, which I also love. And they are the Steamboat Willie, like the Steamboat kind of like Mickey ears. Mm -hmm. And they're in black and white with a little mini print. I love these. Somebody said, I want to go to Homecoming for dinner. I do too. Somebody also pointed out, I I don't look like a serial killer. I'm just reading the comments because they're like right here. So I'm like just down a little bit. Oh no. <laughs> so I'll try to read the comments up at the top. Oh, somebody said that my the ears that I was just wearing, these ears, were giving them Say by the Bell vibes, which oh, yeah. we went to a Say by the Bell pop-up shop when we were in L.A., and um, if you guys want to see that video, if you just search the Tim Tracker Saved by the Bell, that video will pop up. We had so much fun. It was good. We went with Adam, our friend Adam the Woo, and he, like, we all dressed up in, like, 80s not, or 90s clothes. And um, we ate food at the little, like, Max. We went to the Max, basically. Yes. It was so cool. We definitely need some further discussion of revisiting Tokyo. We for sure would like to go to revisit Tokyo. Yes. Like 100%. I want to spend more time. I want to spend like a week at the parks and then a week in Tokyo. Yeah. I also want to go to Universal Japan. Oh, man. I want to go to Universal Japan so I'm bad. I'm sad that we didn't go. They have a parade at Universal Japan that has uh, dinosaurs. Yeah. Like that jump off the parade floats and then walk around. Yeah. Have you gotten any takeout from your favorite restaurants? We have not um, done any takeout whatsoever. Yeah, because we have Jackson, we've yeah. been being as careful as possible. Like we, we have, we've only left the house since Disney closed. We've left the house maybe like three times. Well, because we had to. It was yeah, like, like I needed to get toilet paper was one of the times. Yeah, and we needed. Um, had to go take him to get his shots. Oh, that's right for his doctor's appointment. And the. Th third one was we had some something that we had to do some other thing where are your bow bands from um the bow bands are from rarity by casey on instagram and on etsy compare the cost of tokyo to orlando uh it is cheaper to go to tokyo so cheap to go to tokyo i think like, the most money that we spent was on the flight and because we went with our friends crispy s'more though they said that it was cheaper to fly to tokyo than it was to fly to orlando did they i think so oh wow but there, there's also, like, flights that you have to avoid when going to Tokyo. Because there's some that go into, um, not Shanghai, the other one. Oh, it was um, Hong Kong. 
Wasn't no, it, it wasn't Hong Kong. It was it was mainland China. Oh, well, it was... Beijing. Was it Beijing? I think so. I can't remember. I think they flew into Beijing and they're like, whatever you do, don't uh, don't fly into... Like, what did they say? They said, if you're going to Japan, don't get a layover in China. But if you have to get one, make sure it's not into Beijing. And if you do have to, you can only get one into Beijing, make sure you give yourself at least three hours to get through the airport because you have to go out of customs and back into customs, even though it's just a connecting flight. Uh, and the flight that I found that was like $500 was like you okay? 30 minutes in Beijing. And it's like, well, we would have just been stuck in Beijing. Yeah. So, so we, paid, we, did. we paid the extra to have a, a straight like flight through. Yeah. I'm glad we did too. Yeah. It was a really good flight. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Hey. Um, it is watermelon bubbly and it's delicious. Watermelon bubbly. Ooh, would you rather stay at the Waldorf or the Grand California or Grand Floridian? And I think the Waldorf. I think so too. We that, had the food at the Waldorf, like, oh man. Not only the food, but just like the room that we stayed in was the same price as a, a moderate, re- like as a regular room at the Grand Floridian. No, at a moderate. No. Yeah, I, I looked it up. It was the same as. What's a moderate? As Saratoga or something like that. Are you sure? Yeah. Because we had a suite. Yeah, I know. Oh. It was it was amazing the cost difference. Um, we I definitely recommend the Waldorf though. We just we had the best service there. They were um, just yeah. everything was was great. Like just everything was great. Every time the we go back, they like greet us by name. Yeah, it was really, and it wasn't just us that they were doing that too. Because when we went to breakfast. We went to Oscars, which is where they came up with the Eggs Benedict. Yeah. Like, that's Oscars is, like, where they came up with that dish. The one in New York, not yeah. the one here, but yeah. yeah. Um, but every they were talking to everybody, like, by their first names yeah. and just... You could tell that people had been going back. Yeah. Because they, I remember the table next to us was a family, and they were like, oh, so the last time you were here... Like, they were talking about, like, their previous trips, and it just was... I don't know. It just seemed really awesome, um, the way that just the service was great. Somebody asked Bull and Bear or um, Victoria and Alberts, and I honestly oh, think Bull and Bear. Bull yeah. and Bear. Victoria and Alberts was nice, yeah, but it was uh, like it took too long. I think it was too fancy for me. Yeah, like it wasn't fun for me. Yeah, but Bull and Bear is fun. Yeah, like they and make it fun. Also, you get like way more portions at Bull and Bear. Yeah, and it's cheaper at Bull and Bear too. It is, but I think that the food is just as delicious. Yeah. Um. Somebody asked, where is the Waldorf Astoria? Uh, Bonnet Creek, like right near Typhoon Lagoon, right near, like in between Typhoon Lagoon and Blizzard, or, and uh, downtown, what's it called? Disney Springs. Will you see what that comment says? Uh, you guys remember a wall? Oh, do you remember a, lo- a vlog from a long time ago where you joked you would name your first kid Moonstone Star Child? <laughs> oh, yeah. I do. Moonstone Star Child. Well, it's close. Jackson. That's close, right? Pretty close. <laughs> um, Would you consider doing Super Chats and donating the proceeds? Not currently. Like, because wh- there's like there's so many people that are in a tough place right now. Mm-hmm. I think we'll probably uh, just make a donation yeah, on our own. I think so. Um, Bull and bear chicken is out of this world. Yes, so it's good. so good. I love the gravy on the potatoes. Oh my gosh. Bull and bear is the signature restaurant at Waldorf in Orlando. Mm-hmm. There's another one in New York too, but it's, oh man. Um, Ohana or California grill. And I would have California to say, grill. yeah, California grill. Ohana has really gone, um, like downhill, I think. Yeah. I know some people get mad when I say that, but it's just not the same. Yeah, and it's funny, too, because we've talked to other people that loved Ohana, and then they went back, like, after we said that, and they're like, yeah, it went... Like, people that were, like, excited to go for their birthday or something like that, and they just had, like, a bad experience. It just isn't the same anymore. Uh, Does Yeah, Waldorf does provide Disney transportation, like, uh, buses to the Disney resorts. It is a good neighbor hotel, too, so you can get uh, magic bands, fast passes, 60 days out, and all that other good stuff, too. Yeah. I miss Blaze Pizza too. It's so good. YouTube it was so takes much a huge food part. at Bull and Bear. Yeah, someone says that YouTube takes a huge part of your super chats. They do. They take like forty percent of your super. I think chats. they take less than forty. I think it's thirty percent on super chats. Are you sure? I think so. I think huh. it's less than the ad revenue. Gotcha. Favorite uh, quick service. Ooh, that's ooh, a good question. That is a good question. Quick service. Uh. Um. 
I don't know. I feel like, I mean, Casey's Casey's is good. Uh, what's the Sleepy Hollow is good. You know what oh, I do yeah. like? I like Friar Nook because they have mm -hmm. the tachos and stuff like that. Oh, you know what? Oh, Satouli Canteen. Satouli Canteen. Yeah. And uh, I feel like we did a video on quick service, yeah, didn't we? We did. <laughs> we did. What was our number one? Satouli. Our number one was Satouli. Well, I can't remember. We just did it. This is I, So here's what I found about being in uh, quarantine mm -hmm. is that I've forgotten so many things. It's hard to like, everything is different now. I just can't There's, remember. There's like people's names. Yeah. I was like, somebody tweeted something out and I was like, oh, look, that's. And then I like I eventually remembered it, but like for like a second there, I was like, "Woo!" <laughs> I don't remember right now. Um, yeah, the um, Satuli Canteen and Pandora is considered a quick service because you order the food at the at the counter and you take it back to your table. Yeah. Worst quick service in the Magic Kingdom. Worst quick service. Worst quick service. I don't. No. I will say, this isn't quick service, but I really did not like the Skipper Canteen. Yeah. The last time we went. The first time we went, it was good. Yeah, but the last, the time, last time, the service and the, the food quality was just bad. Yeah. Uh, I can't think of... Like, most of the quick service is all the same food. So it's, like, hard to be, like... Like, there are some, like, Satouli Canteen and Woody's Lunchbox are different. But, like... For the most part, are you trying to grab my hand? We had a shrimp dish at Contemporary's Fast Serve, and it was amazing. Contemporary's oh. Fast Serve. What's was, their, I don't know. Is their, that Contempo Cafe? I'm not That's sure. That's where I ate all those cupcakes oh, that maybe. one day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Best fine dining at Walt Disney World. Oh. Fine dining? Fine dining. Fine. I think it would be like the California Grill, right? Yeah, California Grill. But like, I if like you're their at brunch, Walt though. Disney World, just go over to Bull and Bear. It's literally yeah, like that's true. Like Disney property's weird. It has like a weird outline. Like I saying like Typhoon Lagoon's here. Like you go Typhoon Lagoon is Disney property, and then Waldorf is right next to it, and it's not Disney property. And then across the street is Disney Springs. So it's like you're not far off from Waldorf. Just like pop over. Have you ever had any spa treatments on site? If so, what and where? Not at Disney, um, but we have had them at the Waldorf, and we have had them on Disney Cruise Line. Yeah. Um, oh, and we had them at Alani at Disney, the Disney Resort at Alani. Yeah. And I would say the one at Alani was amazing. It was really good. You couldn't even get the full treatment that I got because no. you were pregnant. Well, that's when, yeah, we, we had just found out that I was pregnant. And yeah. so I was like, no. <laughs> um and then um, the one at on the Disney Cruise Line was so nice. So good. But we but did get confused over the pricing. It was very expensive. Yeah. <clears throat> Somebody said um, Vicky and Al's or Takumi Tai, which you haven't had it yet. No, but I really, really want to go to Takumi Tai. And I think Takumi Tai. Tai, yeah. Takumi Tai, Takumi Tai, Takumi Tai. Um, it's good. It's really good. And it's not like... Oh, no. What? Somebody said that they went to tea at the Waldorf and it was terrible. We love the tea. Really? I'm so sorry. We thought we we thought the tea was so fantastic. We've been a few times. Yeah. Um, what what uh, what, what was happened? the matter? What happened? Yeah. I'm interested. Rise of the Resistance or Smuggler's Mud <laughs> run? I think Rise of the Resistance. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, would you go on allow Alani? I can't talk anymore. Quarantine <laughs> mouth now. Alani or a Disney cruise next? I think. Alani. Yeah? Yeah. We didn't spend enough time at Alani, so I think yeah. that's why I'd want to go back there first. But the Disney Cruise was, uh, th we've been on two of them, and they were both so nice. Yeah. Like, oh. it was just really relaxing, and it was beautiful. Where where did the, the Susan thing come from? Oh, yeah. Somebody left a comment, and they're like, I, I looked it up because I thought it was a vine, but I just found somebody named Susan Vine. <laughs> <laughs> um, so Susan is the Susan CEO. Susan Wallachek. Yeah, she's the CEO of YouTube. And everybody um, is mad at Susan all the time because YouTube is always messing up. And yeah. so every, so we were, something was happening in a live show. I don't remember what was happening. But we were like, Susan! Yeah. Because um, it was messing up and it was Susan's fault. <laughs> and so we always blame everything on Susan. I'm also forgetting things. Are you having weird dreams or is that just me? Oh, yeah. I had the weirdest dream today. But yes, I've been having weird dreams ever since this whole thing started. 
Best character breakfast. Um, best character breakfast. I mean, I liked the character breakfast. I like the one in, and this isn't in Florida, but Storytellers out in California was really good. Oh, yeah. That one is like one of the best ones we've ever done. Yeah. Um, it's at the Grand California. Yeah. Ooh, eggs Benedict. best eggs Benedict is actually at the Waldorf. I know we're like hyping up the Waldorf right now, but like that's where the best eggs Benedict is. How are your plants doing? They're doing really good, actually. They're yeah. growing really fast. I'm interested to see. Oh, I never see you guys hit my fave Columbia Harbor House, but we did. Oh no, we went to Liberty Tree. We went to Liberty Tree. We tried oh, to go to Columbia Harbor House, but, but it was it was a buffet, and we were with our friends who are vegan, and we didn't want to make them pay for a buffet where they couldn't eat all the food. Right. So we're like, oh, we'll just go to Liberty Tree where you can just order a vegan item. But we'll definitely try it when it opens back up. Yeah. Although, do you think buffets are still going to be a thing? No. Because if it's if Columbia Harbor House is a buffet, I think it's going to be uh, family style. Do you think? Yeah. We you should build the Disneyland Railroad set from Lego. We looked we at it. We can get that one too. Yeah. That one's in stock. Uh, did you guys go to Portillo's yet? There's one over. No. We tried to go to the Beef Bus, but the line was two hours long. And then um, we, I've been to the one in Tampa before, but I don't think I filmed it. I. Because I just did the drive through or something. Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember. Yeah. I hope Steve but, the Egyptian is okay. Me too. I feel like, do you think he's going to make it through the refurbishment? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. I feel like the, the, the thing, the, what's that called? The concept art was of Steve the Egyptian. Oh, wait. Somebody said Columbia Harbor House isn't a buffet. Is it not? What is it? It's quick serve. It is? But how come when we were standing outside, it had a buffet menu? It's, it was all you care to eat. Is it? Is it a buffet? Like at dinner time? At dinner time or something? Because when we were looking at it, and we show it in the video, um, it's an all you, can, all you care to eat menu. It's family style. Oh, okay. And it's counter service. Oh, buddy. Okay. Buddy. <laughs> so I think that's why we, maybe that's what it was. Oh, so we just didn't know. Okay. Well, yeah. There you go. Sorry, we don't we don't know. I'm gonna try to feed him again. We never claim to know everything. We definitely don't know everything. <laughs> Hi, my buddy. Oh, no buffet menu. I wonder what we were. Oh, I forgot I had these. these on. Um. Oh, we're confusing the diamond horseshoe. Maybe. Oh, is that what it was? I think you might be right. I think you are right. Oh, okay, sorry. No, that's what it was. No, Columbia Harbor House had the fire alarm going off. Oh. That's why we didn't go in. Yeah, so we went to go. We did try to go there, oh. and there was a fire. Not a fire, but. Yes. Thank you, whoever that was that said we got it confused with uh, the other place. What was it called? I don't I have know. To, I've, that's quarantine, baby. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Hold on, buddy. Hold on, my buddy. Yeah, best voodoo donuts? Ooh, I like the one that's the Oreo, the cookie and cream one. What's the... Uh... Oh, the Briar Patch in Winter Park does have a good breakfast. Um, I used to have some friends that worked there, actually, and, like, just all the food there was so good. Come here, my little buddy. Oh, he farted on me. Did he? Oh, he farted on me. Oh, that little farty boy. Last time we drove anywhere. Uh, uh... We went to take Jackson to the uh, doctor. Yeah. Tim, you scared us. I'm sorry. <laughs> you go, no! <laughs> yeah, that dramatic no. Sorry. I really got... Uh, there's also a lot of seafood, which Tim doesn't eat. That's true. Bandit is asleep downstairs. Would you ever get another motorbike? Hashtag midlife crisis. <laughs> no, I would um, not. I feel like now that we have a baby, for sure, I don't want you to drive a motorcycle. Yeah. I, uh... I would get a little scooter or something for going around the neighborhood. I want to get a golf cart. But I would not buy a motorcycle again. Favorite burger in Disney. So that it's was something that we talked about when we went to um, Trails End. We were talking about the best barbecue. And then we were like, oh, we should probably start out by doing the best burger. Yeah. Because you love burgers. Like, that's your number one thing. Yeah. And then I even asked you what your favorite burger was. And you never answered. There was one at Victoria Falls in Animal Kingdom Lodge, which is really good, mm -hmm. but I don't know if it's always there. So, and the ones at, uh, what's your, who's it? 
<laughs> the ones at Deluxe are sorry. good. He's being so crazy. What are you doing? He's just kicking me like crazy. I'm sorry. He wants to eat and he won't eat. Tesla before motorbike. Yes. As a I matter would of love fact. to get a Tesla. So I saw that they started shipping um, Model Ys. But the only problem is uh, Elon's been being a real doofus during this whole thing. Why? Why? He's been like saying that this isn't as bad as it is and like has he yeah he's just been and apparently he said he was going to ship ventilators like make ventilators i did see this and then he sent like cpap machines or something no he said um i've sent them out but they're they're oh, stuck, yeah, they're in, stuck customs in customs at, at lax and then lax tweeted out and said we don't have any ventilators um send us some more information so we can look into this so yeah. like he lied about it yeah which is weird and it's just like come on man I wish that they would, I don't know, I wish somebody else would make a good electric car. Like, Volvo has one coming out, but, like, it's not as, it costs more than the Model Y. Why it's are we smaller, and, uh... Are we blurry? No, I think that's just every once in a while somebody's, uh, like, connection drops out. Come here, stinky butt. Um. That's quarantine, baby. I, I have a Model 3, and I love it. Dang, wait for R R Rivian, which is Volvo's brand. Oh. Um, I believe. Somebody keeps asking about my necklace, um, and I'm going to have to show you guys in another home vlog because I the box for it is downstairs, so I can show you the brand. Yeah, okay, so somebody said his ventilators did make it, so he did actually send ventilators out, and they were the good kind of ventilators, but he did all these other things before that. I think which because is, he got caught, yeah. and then he had to send them out. What are you doing, Stinky? Oh, we have a Model 3 and it's not really worth the money. Ooh, oh, really? Why is that? It's pixels every now and then. Yeah, I think oh, that that's just... Sorry. That's quarantine, baby. <laughs> Our Susan? <laughs> Susan? Our internet's been being real weird, too. If it's not blurry for everybody, then it's, it's just a connection. Why not Do the Model think... X? Because it's $100,000. <laughs> yeah, that's like, that's crazy. Um, somebody asked, uh, do you think pin trading will stop when the parks reopen? And I do because you can't pin trade in social distance. So, yeah. Is the number of positive cases going down in Florida? The video has been blurry the whole time. Oh, no. Oh, no, has it? Um. What do we do? Well, I think that's just one person because we already asked this question, right? Well, no, because a few people have said it. Yeah, but we asked the question. Everybody's if like, you it looks refresh, amazing. it clears up. Oh, okay. Who has to refresh? We do or you do? No, no, they do. Okay. Um, Good. What are you doing? What about Honda? I don't know if Honda has a... Uh, they had the Insight. I don't know if they still make the Insight. I don't think that was electric. Yeah, it was fully electric. Was it? Yeah. Oh, okay. But it also is too tiny for us and the baby. Wait, wait not blurry. No, not blurry. Right. Okay, so it must just be some people's connection. How long have we been on? Uh, it's been a long time. Has it? Yeah, it's been an hour and 17. <laughs> Man, he's, he's really kicking me hard. I think he's just getting restless. Because he's like literally... Just like punching stuff? Yeah. And I thought he was hungry, but he won't eat anymore. Um, I, reflash, I refreshed and it's not blur anymore. Okay. Um, blur is life. Blur is life. Buddy. Take me out of the house shirt. That would be amazing. That's a really good idea. Oh, that is a good idea. Maybe yeah. we'll do that. Hey, buddy. <laughs> I can't. We can't do That's Quarantine, baby, because it's uh, it, it was a comic that I saw this morning, and I just thought it was funny, so I've been oh. saying it. Get the VW electric. It's not out yet. Oh, no. Is Tiffany leaving? Bye, I want, Tiffany. I really want that. Uh, the micro bus, the VW micro bus. <laughs> that thing is awesome. Buddy. Are you just being a little jumpy guy? Little jumpy guy. Hey um, there. We can hear you, and that's what matters. Okay, good. Susan, top three vines. Ooh. Ooh. I like. And they were roommates. And they were roommates. I like. Um, oh, he did. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I like. Uh, um. Well, I, I like some other so. ones. Oh yeah. I like some other ones, but they have bad words in them, so I can't say them. I like the the nine one one. What's your emergency? Is that a weed? <laughs> like that one? I think that one's hysterical. That one was funny. 
There's the, so many good vines. The e-tron by Audi was also more expensive than the Model Y and smaller. Same thing with the Jaguar. Um, Ford Mustang Mach-E. I didn't even know that that was a thing. Yeah, I didn't either. That sounds fun. Also, that's just a two-door, though, so that's <laughs> small. Oh, somebody, they want a Hey Buddy onesie. Hey, buddy. Oh. Ta -ta -ta Target. <laughs> Susan. Um. Oh. Would you who's, guys... who's the cutest girl in school? Oh, yeah, that's a good one. The, uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> when the guy breaks the glass at the hockey game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I like the one where um, Paul sneezes. Where the what? I'm not allowed to sneeze. <laughs> and the deers all run away. A bee. A bee? Oh, there's so many good ones. Samantha. That's not even a vine, but that's that. See, that's what it is. That it should be a vine. Yeah, that's like that's some vine humor right there in Frozen Two. Hey. Yeah. Samantha. These pretzels are making me thirsty. Look at all those chickens. Oh, that was a good one. Yeah. Uh, Favorite pavilion for me is Japan. Yeah, Japan is awesome. There's a bee? That's what it was. A home vlog shirt. I feel like, would somebody really wear a home vlog shirt? Like, if it just, just says, says home, home vlog? vlog? Just like one, just like real tiny, like right here. No. Home vlog. Because <laughs> I feel like I would love to make all these shirts, but, you know, you have to like pay the artist to make the, the design, and then it's just... Would people actually wear it? Is like I don't know. I wonder. Um, that little babe. Yeah. Oh, oh I would do babe. that. Yeah, I would do that. That would be a cute one. Yeah. How about just Jackson's raspberry noise? How uh, do you do that? Is that allowed? That's a good one. I could have dropped my croissant. We say that all the time. Yeah. Whenever we see anybody doing PDAs, I go, "Is that allowed?" <laughs> I know. It would need to be home vlog. Home vlog. That's with like true. music notes and stuff. Maybe we will. I gotta talk to um the guy the that designs our stuff. The Ford Mustang Mach E is a is an SUV. It is? That's I gotta see this thing. This thing sounds crazy. That does sound very strange. We're looking it up right now. You should dedicate a whole video to talking about vines. It's the Aristocats 50th anniversary. I did not know that. What do we call it? Mach E. I do want to do a Toast the Ghost shirt so bad. I need to talk to the guy and see um, if we can do some shirts. Why Why is it called a Ford Mustang? I don't know. Is it a, It's an SUV? Yeah. It's like... Oh, that is weird. It has a, well, it has a Mustang front. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of... Maybe because it's fast, because it's... A potato flew around my room. That's a good one. That is a good one. <laughs> I am Confucian. I love all of the vines. I thought you were American. <laughs> <laughs> and then, what are those? Oh, somebody They're... said, would we drive through an empty Disney for a video? And we would not, only because you're not supposed to do that. Right. There are, like, the the security guards are there. Well, and it's a shelter-in-place order right now, so you're not supposed to leave your house unless you absolutely have to. Right, going to the grocery store or something like and that. And that's not a reason to leave your house. Like, making content for your channel is not a reason to leave your house right now. Right. So the people that are doing that, it's actually kind of upsetting because they're setting a bad example. Okay, this is pretty good. 300 mile range. That's not bad. Oh, and it has... I believe it uses the same underbody platform as the Mustang. Okay. Watch your profanities. <laughs> Watch your profanity. Ooh, 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 ooh jobber. Much? That's a good one, too. You guys oh, know all it? the good vines. It looks pretty cool on the inside, too. Oh, it looks very similar to the Tesla. Yeah, but like, how how much is this? Where's the babe? He's right here, just making weird noises. Which babe? This babe. The babe with the power? Yeah. This one right here. I know Judas. more. <laughs> <laughs> I still, there's... I think I know more about American Girl Dolls than well, you do, yeah, genius. Well, yeah, see, starting at $43,000. That's not bad for an electric car. But I feel like, is that the lowest, like, what's the top level? 60000 for the GT? The, like, you go faster? I don't, I don't know what the GT does. Let's... But it says it's including the tax credit, and the tax credit isn't a thing anymore. Oh, yeah. I need to get rid of that thing. So, how, yeah, how does that... No, Favorite... no, no, no. It says not including. 
Oh, okay, but you don't get the tax credit anymore. They right. took it away. But like it's just saying, like you could. No, you can't. They took if, it away. If you some maybe if it comes back. Oh, the Mach E first released are already sold out, but I believe I can't read the rest. Mach E is already sold out. Why? Let's see here. My kid says he thinks the Ovo Java vine is the best. <laughs> I don't know Ubu Java. <laughs> um, I can't find where it says. It is for Ford. How about a tracker home tour? So we actually did a home tour um, when we first moved. So that would have been like two years ago. If you look for house tour or home tour, if you search, if you're ever looking for a video and you're like, I wonder if Tim made a video about this and you search the Tim tracker all like together as one word and then you search whatever it is that you're looking for. So if you search the Tim tracker home tour or home uh, house tour, it'll pull right up. Walk away. Oh, that one's so good too. You guys know them all. Miss Keisha, Miss Keisha. <laughs> Happy birthday, happy birthday, Raven. I can't, I can't swim. swim. <laughs> <laughs> I like the one where she's like, I nap here. What's a Vine? Um, Vine was a website that would, it was like it was six like seconds. Seven, six seconds? Yeah. I smell like beef. Chipotle is my life. <laughs> I smell like beef. <laughs> oh my goodness. The Nissan Leaf is too small. When, we, when it first came out, I test drove one and it was nice, but it's too small. Somebody keeps asking if we're going to go to Cedar Point, and we for sure would like to go. It's just that right now it's not really an option, but yes. Ow. Buddy, you scratched me. Oh, we got this question a few times about the... Why are you running? <laughs> Hurricane Katrina, more like Hurricane Tortilla. <laughs> I like the why are you running one. Um, okay, so somebody asked... Um, so, okay, sorry, I like lost my train of thought. That's because of the vines. So it is because of the vines. So we used to have a website that we use called Spreadshirt. We still use Spreadshirt to sell our merchandise, but we put the Spreadshirt link on our website, which is timtracker.com. So you're still buying your merch, our merch, from Spreadshirt, but it's just on our website, if that makes sense. So it's all the same. Because somebody was asking if they if they buy our merch from Spreadshirt. Oh, yeah, it's the same thing. Or if they buy our merch from our website, but it's all the same. It's just two different like play ways to get to the site. Uh, I bought a Chevy Bolt over a Model 3 and it was a better idea. The Chevy Bolt was just too small for me. It is the Bolt or the Volt? The, both, but the we have the Volt, but okay. the Bolt is even smaller than the Volt. And the whole reason that we would even consider a different car than the Bolt is for size. Because everything's yeah. like a little bit tight with Jackson in there now. Mary Chrysler. Mary Chrysler. <laughs> Free Shavakadu. Free Shavakadu. <laughs> I love that lady's laugh. Oh, Magic in Michigan says, I love my Ding Dang shirt. Thank you for buying our merch. We appreciate it. It's freaking bats. bats. I love Halloween. Camping at Fort Wilderness. Yeah, sure. We, like, like when well, That was one of the things we wanted to do, and then the world changed. Country boy, I, I love, love you. you. Uh. <laughs> What range do you have with the Volt? On Pure Electric, we have between 55 and 62 miles, depending on uh, how I'm driving that day. Yeah. So, like, if I'm going under the speed limit, I do much better, but then I'm also driving under the speed limit. So, I'd like to be able to, um, to do, like, go the speed limit. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know? Favorite food in Japan, like in actual Japan, like the actual country of Japan, or the buddy, 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 or the um, like Japan pavilion. Because when we went to Japan, we went to this little place. If you've not seen our Japan playlist videos, we went to this place when we were in Tokyo. So it wasn't in Disney. It was in like the city of Tokyo. Yeah. And we went to this little tiny eatery in like a back alley. Um, with some of our friends were actually in Japan at the time. So we met up with them and they toured us around and then we went to this little place and we had this fish and it was like a mackerel, I think. Oh. I don't know what kind of fish it was, but it was so good. It was just fish. It was just a fish on a plate. Somebody said, road work ahead. I sure hope it does. <laughs> Funny story. He lives in Orlando and our friend ran into him at Publix. Yeah. 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 
Um, Best remove him. Best remove him. Oh, and his uh, mm. now wife used to work at Universal. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Wow. Stop it. Get some help. <laughs> <laughs> Was that scary? Where did we get the Arrow Garden? We got it on Amazon. Can I please get a waffle? <laughs> Excuse me. Can I, can I get a waffle? Can I please get a waffle? Um, oh, no. Did you poop? Did you poop? You smell. Smell pretty bad. Have you ever done Pick a Pearl in Japan? We showed it one time and oh, people got really mad. People got mad. I didn't realize you don't think about it when you're seeing them do it, but I guess they like are killing the oysters. Yeah, the oysters are dying. Yeah, and they're not using them for food or anything. Or maybe are they? I don't know. I don't know. So people were upset with it, so we didn't show it anymore. Um Chloe, we're going to Disney. <laughs> That was my impersonation of her. Chloe. Wait, hold on. How many pounds is Jackson? I feel like... 18. He might be more than that now. Mm, I think he's 18. Hold on, let me... Yeet. Is that... I don't know if that's a... That was a vine because she like threw her soda. Oh, yeah. Hold on, I gotta look Fish in a back alley, yeah. Which is kind of strange because like in America, so you totally would not do that. But in I'm, Japan? I'm telling you. Totally it fine. was so delicious. We it also, was the best. We went to this uh, ramen place that was like in the basement of some place. You had to like go down some stairs and it was like pouring out. But you ordered your food from a vending machine. You ordered your ticket from a vending machine. Yeah. And then you went into the place and waited for a seat to open up because there were like six seats. Yeah, and I think it wasn't good. We didn't enjoy our food. No, because we couldn't read the menu. The food was, was good. Yeah. We just couldn't read the menu. Right, and they had an English menu on the side so you could like match up the pictures. But there was like people behind us. And I'm sure that it would have been fine if we had just like taken our time because the people in japan are very nice yeah and like very understanding but because we're american we were like we're like uh, uh, they're gonna yell at us and yeah. we just like picked something and it was bad <laughs> well yours was fish based yeah and I, so you couldn't eat it yeah and it then, could have but it probably would have made me a little barfy yeah and then mine was i don't remember why i didn't like mine i think you ate mine and then i ate yours i think so but then we also got um goyoza gayos Goy I can't pronounce uh, it. Gyoza. Yeah, and those were good. We will definitely be doing some more Disney from home videos. They just take a long time to edit and plan out. So um, we don't, we're don't. we not going to be doing them like every week, but we will do another one for sure. And then... Uh, Thank you, Tiffany. The best uh, sushi that you ever had was in it was, a train station. Yeah, it was literally in the train station and it was so good. Oh, no. no. What do you have? A knife! No! no! <laughs> I love how she goes, no! That is such a funny video. Oh, my goodness. Um, yeah. Could so you, you drink think... the water in Japan? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But also, they have really cool vending machines. Oh, yeah. So we kept doing, like, vending machine stuff. Yeah, they had, like, like hot drinks in vending machines and, like, um, delicious. It was just everything was good. Everything. And then they also... Oh, dang. What was... The, I was about to say something about Japan. Oh, the food at 7-Elevens was good, too. Yeah, there's so many videos on YouTube of people just going to 7-Eleven and eating. And yeah. they have, like, the most delicious stuff. And then the, we also found a video of somebody on... Oh, no. Oh, what? Somebody said that um, their dog was barking at Jackson's fart noises. Oh, no. <laughs> Sorry. He just thought... He just loves to do it. Um. So there's a guy that we met a long time ago... Oh, somebody said the best katsu they had was in a Kyoto train station. Oh, yeah. I believe it. Uh, there's a guy that we met a long time ago. His name is Eric Surf Six, mm -hmm. like old school YouTube. And he lives in Japan. And one of his more recent videos that he did, he went to a, like a tire shop, like where you get your tires changed on your car. Mm -hmm. And that guy had like this huge setup of vintage vending machines where you could get like ramen and like hot food like bowls of hot soup and stuff like that and i thought it was really interesting huh because like how are you getting and they were like all from like the 80s and oh. they were still working and like the guys would come out and like refresh the food and stuff like that every once in a while <laughs> oh i do that <laughs> um oh no yeah. what was that what was it 
I don't know, something... Oh, it was a string. Oh. Um, Do you think... Because I don't want this to be too, too long. Oh, and yeah, we're at, I feel like we... Half now. And we still have to film our vlog for today. Um, or for tomorrow. But, um... Ding, dang. Yeah. Would I you want... recommend the Hilton that you stayed at? Yes. Yes, it, it was, was so awesome. good. They were so nice. They thanked us. So most people who stay at the Hilton, they only stay for like four days. We stayed for six days. Yeah. Because you can only get a four-day pass to Disney World. Or Disneyland. Tokyo yes. Disneyland. You can buy more tickets, but like the pass, like the... And, well, it's, it's cheaper to buy an annual pass after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so... But they were saying, when we checked out, they said most people don't stay as long as we stayed. And they really appreciated our business. Yeah. And they were just bless so... Bless Bless Bless. bless. They were just so nice. They gave us, like, a, a gift for staying. They gave us, like, candy. Yeah, and it was just, I don't know, they were so nice. And then we paid for the club level, so we got to, like, have us, um, you know how you could do club level at the Disney resorts and you yeah. get, like, food and stuff? Yeah, yeah, So we got delicious breakfast. We got... Yeah, breakfast every day. And it was so good. It was, like, the best food. It was really good. Yeah, we had an amazing time at the Hilton. And the room was actually really nice. The bathroom was really nice. Um, the beds were comfortable. But it was weird because we went with crispy s'mores and normally they would do like two queen size beds, but they did four twin beds. Yeah. So we all had our own individual beds. Yeah. So that was a little bit strange. Um, but honestly, it was, it was very nice. Um, somebody asked if I got a new wedding ring and I did get a new ring because my actual wedding ring didn't, it stopped fitting on my finger when I got pregnant. <laughs> so I wanted to wear my ring. Um, so I got this one to be able to still wear a wedding ring yeah and it doesn't have it's just like a plain band so nothing can get like caught on jackson or anything yeah because when i tried to put my other ring on the one that like has the diamond it um it was scratched it like scratched him so i was like oh i don't want to wear that anymore yeah everybody most people in japan especially around tokyo disney and at the airport speak Perfect English. Somebody said, how was the English at the Hilton? Yeah. Um, but yeah, everybody, and if they couldn't, like, if you couldn't communicate, so there was a time that we were in the parks, and um, I don't I don't speak Japanese, and the employee didn't speak English, so we couldn't communicate. She pulled out her phone, and she's like, type your question. You know, she was like, put your question in here. So I typed it in English. It translated it to Japanese for her, and then she answered in Japanese, and it translated it to English for me. Right. So we were still able to communicate, which was great. And then um, the only time that we ever had any trouble with a language barrier was in the back alleys of Tokyo. So, I mean, if you are, like, explorative, yeah, then you might have some issues with uh, language barriers. But there are kind of a lot of, like, words that are easy to, to know. Yeah. You know, like, you can say hello and thank you and, um, yeah. you know, goodbye and like maybe like learn like water and stuff like that but like there are things like if you're ordering sushi sushi is sushi yeah teriyaki is teriyaki the other thing though is that most places have a like a picture of the food or yeah. an actual like dish of the food out yeah um but yeah i like i want to give a shout out to tiffany ann every time that we do a premiere or a live show she always says like everybody hit the thumbs up button it doesn't show up i don't know why oh, it's because it there's too many emojis it goes to spam we can still see it but it goes to spam yeah um but yeah tiffany ann thank you so much and we always see your comments on the videos every day so we just want to say thank you Ooh. so i think we're going to call it a day i think so yeah so we're going to um do another live show on Tuesday where we will do more of the mail. Oh. And we're just going to keep doing that until we finish with the mail. Somebody says hi from Japan. Oh, hi. And I feel like... Hello. Their name is something like Mimi. Because it's the same character twice? I wonder yeah. what it says. Well, I think it, that's what I, I'm trying to learn Japanese again. And the hardest part is the characters. Um, and I think it was here. Oh, really? <laughs> but maybe not. That's cool. Man, well, thank you guys so much to everybody who came out to the show. We really, really appreciate it. We um, had a lot of fun chatting with you guys today. Thank you for giving us all the vines. We definitely love, like, the vines, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. Um, and Jackson was in it for, like, the most part today, too. Did you love it? Yeah. He I'm going to give you a little close-up of him. 
What do you think? Hello. He sees himself in the other computer. Oh, yeah? Are you, you seeing, seeing yourself? yourself? Look. You see yourself over there? No, he's looking at the comments. He's like, what are people saying about me? What are they saying about me? <laughs> Whoa. He's just jumping. He's a little jumping guy today. Yeah. So, um, thank you guys so much for coming, and we will see you guys on Tuesday, mm -hmm. but we will see you tomorrow with a pre-recorded video. Yes. So. So, thank you guys so much. Yes, yeah, we really had a lot of fun today. Thank you. Yeah, and we will see you guys on Tuesday. Oh, and the next one, should we do more ears? Like, should we... Oh, yeah, did you guys like the ears? Like, it was. it's kind of sort of like going back and forth between ears and answering questions and answering questions and ears. I think it was more answering questions than anything. Yeah. But we can uh, show more ears next time. Get the Harry Styles yeah. shirt. I'm going to order it right now. Yeah, I want to get so, it. I do want to get it. Um, what do you guys think? I'm trying to, I'm waiting for to see yeah, what it takes, they say. It takes a little bit of time for the uh, the chat to catch up. It was awesome hearing his chatter. <laughs> Pumpy, umpy, umpkin. Yes, more ears. I like the ears. More ears. Okay, okay so cool. then next Friday, um, Tuesday we'll do a mail vlog, and then next Friday we will do a, more of the ear tour to show you guys. Yeah. So. So thank you guys again. Yeah, thank you guys. Have a good day. Wash your hands. We love you. Yeah. Mm. Bye, everybody. Bye. Say bye, Jackson. Bye, Jackson. Bye.